Hello, welcome, welcome, welcome everybody. Good night. Hi, good night, Jonathan. How are you? I'm good. Perfect, nice. I like to hear that. So let me, you know, open the resources for tonight class, okay? So let's wait for your peers. To join okay so perfect let's see what do we have here okay perfect so how are you everybody okay so let's see uh how are you everybody Okay, perfect, nice. Uh, welcome, welcome everybody, welcome Jamlet. So, perfect guys. Let me, you know, share you for tonight class, guys. We are going to have a very interesting topic. So let's see, let me share you the presentation for you. We have this one, okay. Mientras se uno los demás, vamos, you know, to make a, a, a feedback, okay? un repaso acerca de los temas, right? So, guys, we, you know, we saw this one, the previous class, right? Vimos esto en la clase anterior, los numbers, right? So, how to form each one, right? So, you see, del 0 al 10, cambian, right? Tenemos 11, 12, luego... Siguen los team, right? 13, 14, 15, right? Hasta llegar al 20. Luego del 20, lo único que se agrega es 1 hasta el 9, right? 21, 22, 15. Después 30, 31, 40, 41, 50, and so on, right? Hasta llegar al 100. O sea, tenemos el 101, 102, luego 200. 300, 400, and 500, right? And the rest. So 1,000, mil, right? 1,001, mil y uno. 2,000, 10,000, 100,000, okay? 100 mil, uh, 100 mil, uh, 100 mil dollars, well, 100 mil. 1 million, 1 million, 10 million, right? So perfect, guys. Before to start for, you know, antes de iniciar con la clase de hoy, chicos, déjenme share you the screen. Um, I want to check something, okay? Quiero mostrarles algo. Let me see. What do we have? Ah, here. Okay. So, guys, uh, we have this, right? The model. So, hoy, chicos, vamos a terminar el módulo número tres, right? Unit number three. Why? Because tomorrow we are going to have the exam, okay? Mañana es el examen, okay? So, tenemos que estar preparados, okay? Ustedes no, pueden, no van a poder realizar el examen si no han terminado el, en la sección 1, 2 y la 3, right? Por eso tienen que estar terminados, right? Because the exam will be about all of this. El examen va a ser acerca de todo eso, okay? So, guys, let me show you here. Déjenme mostrarles. So, de la sección 3, esto ya lo realizamos, right? Que era esta parte, right? A conversation. Era una conversation. Luego, uh, yesterday, we finished this, right? Ayer terminamos esta parte, right? Right, guys? We finished this, right? Terminamos esto. So, for tonight, we are going to finish hoy en la clase. So, Van a ver que va a ser bastante fácil. Vamos a terminar este ejercicio, ¿ok? You will see it's really easy. Es bastante fácil. But first, guys, let's see what do we have for tonight, ¿ok? Pero primero vamos a ver qué tenemos el día de hoy, ¿ok? So welcome for the ones that are joining today. So welcome, José, Juan, and José Monge. Welcome. Welcome, guys. So let me share you the screen for tonight. Let me share you. 
So this is the presentation, right? So for tonight, guys, we are going, you know, to have first this conversation, okay? We are going to discuss this conversation, okay? Mm -hmm. We are going to create groups and we are going to discuss this. But first of all, primero déjenme explicarles cómo se, cómo se pronuncia cada uno, okay? So tenemos, we have Emily and Randy. So let's say, hey, Randy, how is it going? How is it going? I'm good, Emily. And you? I'm good. I heard you have a new friend. Yes, his name is John. Can you tell me what your new friend look like? He's around 25 years old. He's a white complexion and he's very tall around six feet. Wow, that is tall. Yeah, and he's muscular and he has short black hair. Oh, I hope I could meet him. Sure, I will introduce him. I will, I will introduce him too soon. That's good. See you. See you, Emily. Okay, guys. We are going to, you know, practice this conversation. Vamos a practicar esta conversación con sus compañeras, okay? Les voy a mandar la foto, guys, so you can practice, okay? Si ven sus caritas, pues, ahí las van a ver, right? Los que estamos conectados. So, let me see. We are seven right now. Um, déjenme abrirles los rooms, guys. So, let's see. Okay, so we are going to open the rooms so we are going to practice okay guys let's see three rooms perfect so please if you can accept the invitation of the rooms si pueden aceptar la invitación eh, ya les mandé la foto al grupo de whatsapp so pueden leerla okay vamos a practicar okay practice okay i want you to speak your speaking quiero que practiquen su hablado okay so come on guys Disculpe, pero... yeah puede volver a mandar la foto Sure. Ponerla y es que ah, okay. mi teléfono no lo tengo sin carga. Ok, no te preocupes. Aquí lo tienes. Así que puedes tomar una foto si quieres. Ok, vamos a hacer eso. 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 Eh, se me desapareció lo de la invitación. Oh, really? Okay, déjame. Sí. Uh... Bueno, te voy a enviar este room, Maria, and then you can move it, okay? So you, can you accept it now? Okay, he's around. Me escuchas? Sí, sí, te escucho. Va. Uh, he's around 25 years old. He has a wife. 25 years old. He, he has a white complexion and he's very tall. Around six feet. Wow. That, that is Thai? Yeah, and he's, he's muscular and has short black hair. Oh, I hope cool 
Could me call me him? Sure. I will introduce him to you soon. That's good. Stay you. So welcome, welcome, welcome guys, welcome. So let's see guys, let's see. Okay. So perfect guys, perfect. Welcome, welcome. Okay, perfect. Okay, so hello guys. We are going to wait, you know, for the rest of your class. Vamos a esperar para los que vengan. Pero ya que ustedes dos están aquí, guys, well, you can, you're going to help me reading this, okay? Van a ayudar, ayudarme leyendo esto, okay? So, well, let's see. Jamile, you are going to be Emily and Jonathan Randy, okay? So let's start reading, okay? Let's start. Hey Randy, how it's how's it how's it going? I am good, Emily. How are you? I'm good. I heard you have a new friend. Yes, it's not its name is young. Can you tell me what your new friends look like? He's he is around 25 years old. He has a wit complexion and he's very tight, around six feet. Whoa, that is tall. Yeah, and he, and he is muscular and has short black giant. Oh, I hope I could meet him. Sure, I will, I will introduce him to you, see, him to you soon. That's good, see you. See you, Emily. Okay, perfect. Nice, guys. Perfect. Thank you very much for your participation. Okay, and for the rest, thank you for coming, guys. Welcome, everybody. So, guys, before, you know, antes, que todo, first of all, um, we had a homework, right? Teníamos una tarea anteriormente, right? About countries, nationalities, and language. Remember? ¿Se acuerdan, chicos? So, uh, I want to see... Who, who didn't finish this homework? ¿Quién no hizo esa tarea, guys? Let me know. Recuerden que íbamos a hacer country, nationality, and language, okay? Because we are going to use it, okay? Vamos a usar esa tarea el día de hoy, okay? So, because if you don't know, for tonight, we are going to talk about adjectives, okay? Adjectives. And this will be really important, okay? But first of all, guys, déjenme mostrarles esta imagen, okay, sorry, okay, perfect, so guys, you see here, you see many people, right, you see some people here, you see muchas personas aquí, right, and this one, let's start with the first one, so you say, he's, okay, he's, he's, él es really tall, what is tall, guys, tall, what is tall in Spanish, Tall? Does anybody know? Alguien Alto. sabe? Alto, perfect. So he's really tall, right? Si lo miramos, es alto, right? He's really tall. Now, this one. He's short. He's short. So what is short, chicos, en este caso? Short. Él es pequeño, right? Pequeño, bajo, right? 
Perfect. Okay, now this one. She's a little heavy. She's a little heavy. What is heavy, guys? Heavy? Then. Come on. Yeah, Jose? Well, he uh -huh. heavy is como pesada, right? Pesado. So she's a little heavy. It's un poco pesada, right? Now we have this one. This woman, okay, yeah, yeah, this woman. She's thin, thin, okay, thin. What is thin, guys? Thin is como delgada, right? Thin, thin, okay, delgada. Now, this one. She's really friendly. What is friendly? Friendly, si, se, si quitamos la L y la Y, dice friend, right? Friend, and what is friend? Amigo, right? Amigable. Amigable, Amigable. perfect. En este caso, she's really friendly. Ella es bastante amigable. Friendly, amigable, amistoso, amistosa, right? Friendly. Okay. So, now this one. He is handsome. He is handsome. He is handsome. Él es handsome significa guapo, right? Guapo. Lo decimos más que todo para los hombres, okay? Handsome, guapo, okay? Now, this one. She's very pretty. Okay? Repitan, guys. Pretty. 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 No pretty. 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 Okay? She's very pretty. Okay? Ella es bastante... Uh, sería bonita, right? Bonita. Now, esta palabra... They are good looking. Se está refiriendo a ellos dos. They are good look. They, they use for that. They are, they are good looking. Ellos son de buen parecido, se puede decir. Ellos son de buen parecido. Now, his, this one, se pronuncia, chicos, no es quiet. Esta es quiet. Okay, quiet, quiet. He's quiet. Él es calmado, right? Como calmado, right? She's talkative. Talkative es como alguien hablante, right? Talkative. She's serious. Well, serious. Ya saben, es casi como en el español, right? Seria. And he's funny. Funny. Funny significa divertido, okay? Como de, gracioso en este caso, gracioso. Okay, he's funny. Él es gracioso. She's, no es she, guys, no es she, es shy, okay, shy, shy, aquí shy, shy significa tímido o tímida, okay, tímido o tímida, shy, okay, so now guys, let me show you this one, okay, this is how we can, you know, talk about people, okay, esto es como podemos hablar de las personas, okay, how to describe people, okay, para describir a las personas, our friends, family, okay, so we have this one, okay, this example. My friend John, mi amigo John, is really tall. Mi amigo John es bastante alto, okay, tall significa alto, right? Really tall. Now this one. My cousin Mary is a little short, okay? Mi prima María es un poco pequeña, right? Now, my coworker Chris is a little heavy. Mi um, compañero de trabajo Chris es un poco pesado, right? It's a little heavy, okay? Now, guys, let me, you know, show you more adjectives, okay? So we can learn about it, okay? Let me show you this screen. So let's see. Okay, I saw this first, okay? So now, guys, let me show you how to describe people and personalities, okay? So let's see this one, okay? So we have the first one. Kind woman, a selfish man, you see? Kind woman, kind, you see, kind. She's kind because she's giving things to poor people, right? Or homeless. So kind is como amable, okay? Amable. 
Selfish is, what is selfish, guys? Do you know what is selfish? Any idea? Selfish? Selfish, do you have an idea? Alguien sabe que es selfish? Yes, no? Yeah? No? Okay. Mm, well, selfish. Tacaño o egoísta, right? Egoísta, podría. Egoísta, right? Selfish. Now we have this one. We have friendly. Okay, we know what is friendly, right? Friendly, amistoso, amistosa, right? Friendly man, friendly woman. Y ahora aquí, unfriendly. Si friendly es amistoso, ¿qué sería unfriendly, guys? What will be unfriendly? Mm -hmm. Friendly, amistoso, unfriendly, ¿qué sería? Yes, lo puesto amistoso. Amigable. Yeah, no amigable, no amistoso, apático, right? Unfriendly, right? Unfriendly. So nice. Now we have this one. Honest man, un hombre honesto. And he, she is a liar. Liar, esta palabra, chicos, significa mentiroso, mentirosa, right? Liar. Now we have this one. Cheerful man or woman. Serious, okay? Serious and cheerful. Cheerful is this, right? Esto es cheerful, right? Start cheerful. And this is serious, right? Esto es estar serio, right? Now, responsible man and irresponsible man, okay? Responsible, irresponsible. Hardworking and lazy, okay? Hardworking. Esto es hardworking, right? Tra un trabajador duro, right? Alguien que trabaja y lazy. Es un aragán, right? Lazy, okay? Hardworking, lazy, okay? Hardworking, lazy. Now, faithful, unfaithful, okay? Faithful, unfaithful. Leal, desleal, okay? Leal, desleal. You see? Then we have this, one, right? So what was this, guys? ¿Qué era esto, chicos? What adjective? This one? If you know Cares. the answer, which amable. one? Yeah, amable, kind, right, kind. 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 And this one? Egoista. Egoista. How do you say egoista in English? Selfish. Selfish, perfect. Now, ¿cómo se dice amistoso o amistosa en English? Friendly. 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 ¿Y cómo se dice apático o no amistoso? Unfriendly. Unfriendly. Perfect. Now, well, this is honest, right? ¿Cómo se dice mentiroso en inglés? Mentiroso. Liar. Liar. Perfect. Now, this one. Personas con ánimo, ¿cómo se diría? Cheerful. Cheerful. And this one? Serious. 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 Perfect. Responsable in English. How do you say responsable? Responsible, right? And irresponsable, irres irresponsible. So now, guys, let me move on, okay? So we have, because we have more things, right? So we have this one, okay? Basic description, okay? La descripción es básica. Por ejemplo, tenemos he, she, is, podemos decir about the age, acerca de la edad podemos decir he's teenager, he's young, he's middle age, early, in 20s, in 30s, 40s. Teenager, guys, es una edad, right? Teenager es adolescente, right? Adolescente. Teenager, tenemos young, joven, middle age, edad media, Elderly, son como los ancianos, right? In his 20s, en sus 20s, 30s, 40s, right? Eso es acerca de la edad, right? Age. And what about, you know, looks? You know, opinion, looks. So we have handsome. What was handsome, guys? Get a handsome? 
handsome? Guapo. Guapo, perfect, handsome. So tenemos handsome, he's handsome, right? Él es guapo. Tenemos good looking, good looking, como, es como de buen ver, right? De buen ver, attractive, tenemos pretty, tenemos beautiful, gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous significa elegante, okay? Gorgeous. Tenemos ahora el hate, que es como eh, su altura, ¿verdad? La altura. Tenemos short, tall, very tall, or around one, six, five centimeters, right? So short, bajo, tall, alto, very tall, bastante alto, right? Y around, que significa como cerca, como around, you know, 100, you know, this one. So you can say he is short. Él es bajo. He is tall. Él es alto, right? We have as well body type. Tenemos el tipo de cuerpo, right? We have a skinny. A skinny es para esa gente que, que como que ya no come, ¿verdad? Como que está pura calavera, right? Skinny, que es súper delgado, right? Tenemos thin. Thin es delgado, okay? Thin, delgado. A slender. Slender sería como alguien que tiene un cuerpo como promedio, right? Promedio. Well built es como alguien que tiene músculos, right? Alguien que va al gym, right? Sexy. Well, you know what is sexy. Muscular, musculoso. Chubby. Chubby son para las personas esas que son gorditas, right? Chubby. Y fat. Fat también es gordo, pero fat. Al, se usa como una manera bien grosera de decir gordo, right? Fat, okay? Es mejor decir chubby, okay? Chubby. So, también tenemos complexion. Podemos decir she or he has white skin, que okay? ella tiene piel blanca, white, white skin, fair skin, brown skin, or she has brown hair, okay? Pelo café, dark hair, okay? So we have this one as well. Now let me move on, guys. Let me show you uh, this one, right? For example, this one. He is, you know, age and looks, okay? Uh, how to describe these people, right? So now let me show you, guys, again, the presentation, okay? Déjeme mostrarle la presentación one more time. This one, okay? So we have here, guys. Tenemos aquí... Some of, you know, the adjectives. Algunos adjetivos más que podemos ocupar, ¿ok? Para el tamaño de la persona, the height. Tenemos tall, medium weight, short, ¿ok? Tenemos fat, fit, thin. Tenemos age, old, middle age, young. Face, round face, you know, round. Long, oval. Tenemos también para los hombres, hay mustache, que okay, el bigote, beard, que okay, la barba beard, y para el cabello tenemos los diferentes colores, right? Brown, dark, red, fair or blonde, speaky, curly, wavy, straight, long, short, bold, ok? Personas calvas, bold, right? Bold. Okay. Pelo liso. A straight hair, okay, straight. El pelo ondulado, wavy hair, okay. Pelo ondulado, wavy hair. El pelo colocho, curly, okay, curly hair, curly, okay. And then we have eyes, okay. Brown, green, blue, small, big, okay. The colors of your eyes, okay. You can say black, brown, okay. So, Perfect, guys. Now, let me help you how to create, you know. Déjenme ayudarles and explain you cómo pueden hacer una sentence, ¿ok? Cómo pueden describir a una persona. So, first of all, primero, vamos a utilizar el subject, ¿ok? Vamos a escoger un subject. Puede ser my mother, my father, my friend, you, he, she, it, ¿ok? Cualquier subject, ¿ok? Luego, agregamos el verb to be. Si estoy hablando de una persona, Recordemos, voy a ocupar el is, ¿ok? For example, she is, he is, my mother is, my father is, my friend is, ¿ok? Is. Y luego solo se agrega el adjetivo, ¿ok? El adjetivo. En este caso, beautiful, right? So you see, my mother, subject, 
verbo to be is el adjective. Beautiful. You see? Simple like that. See the facile, okay? Let me make another one. So let's see. My friend, okay, my friend, okay, ya tengo el sujeto, subject. Now verb to be is, um, let's see, handsome, okay, handsome, okay. Mi amigo es guapo, okay, you see? Simple like that, okay. Now let's see, ahora vamos a ver cómo diría yo que alguien tiene un pelo color, let's see, uh, oscuro, okay, un pelo oscuro. Let's see, um, my uh, father, okay, my father, en este caso, ya no que utilizar el verbo to be, porque voy a decir tiene, okay, tiene en inglés es, en este caso, has, okay, has, y ahora digo, ¿Cómo se dice negro en inglés, chicos? ¿Negro? ¿Negro en inglés? Black. Black. Has black y cabello. ¿Cómo se dice? Black. Se dice... Hair. 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 So my father... Hair black. Yeah, black. En este caso, black hair, ¿ok? My father has black hair. Can you see? Black hair. ¿Ok? And now, guys, let's see. ¿Qué más podemos hacer con los adjetivos? Let's see. Um, do you remember the homework that we have about the countries, right? acerca de los países y las nacionalidades? ¿Cómo diría que alguien es de Alemania? Que él es, al, él es alemán. ¿Cómo lo diría? Digamos, he is... ¿Y cómo se dice alemán o alemana en in, in English? Germany. Germany, okay. He is German, okay. You see? This one is as well. La nacionalidad también es un adjective, un adjetivo, right? Because he's describing people. Now, guys, let's see. Let's move on to this one, okay? So we are going to do this exercise together, okay? Vamos a hacer este ejercicio, okay? Les voy a mandar esta foto al grupo de WhatsApp y vamos a describir, ok, vamos a describir describe your mother, your father ok, nos vamos a preguntar estas preguntas ok, voy a dividirlos otra vez en grupos para que trabajemos, ok and we can answer this question ok, pueden revisar el grupo de whatsapp, ahí están las preguntas, ok, let me make it again, let's see two groups, ok, vamos a hacer solo dos esta vez, so you can accept, ok, the invitation guys, ok Perfect. So the rest can accept the invitation, please. Nice. Jonathan, if you can accept the invitation, please. Pequeña, como se decía? Short. Short. ¿Cómo? Short. Short. My mother is short. Eh, friendly. Eh, my mother is a... Uh, Funny. Uh, my mother is a uh, bright. Uh, my uh, my father is a uh, in black. Creo que así lo puedo decir. My father is a uh, mechanic. Uh, my father is a uh, fat. Sí.
Eh, vale, lo voy a hacer yo. Eh, my mother is very happy. Eh, my father is friendly. And my best friend eh, has no, my, my best friend has a and I can relax it. No sé cómo se dice. No sé. Colocho sería rizado. Curtin. Yeah. Colocho. No, pues, my best friend has curly hair. Curly hair. Y el, no sé, presidente. Eh, no sé qué decir del presidente. Ah, va, o este, un dadoso, este, algo así. No, hombre, este. <risa> my president is. Ah, aquí está, ¿no? My best friend is short, pretty. My president is kind, friendly. Hello, solamente, ¿verdad? Solamente. Okay, perfect. Welcome, guys. Welcome. Welcome, everybody. So perfect, guys. Now I'm sharing you the screen. So, well, you know, this is a way, guys, we can, you know, describe people, right? Remember, you have to say first the subject, verb to be, and the adjective, right? So, for example, my friend John is really tall. Okay. And here we have some adjectives. So, As well, if we want to say that someone has something, si queremos decir que alguien tiene algo, podemos ocupar has, ok, has. So, cuando vamos a ocupar has, podemos decir para cuando eh, el cabello, right? Tiene black hair, tiene mustache, tiene bigote, right? Cuando tiene cosas en su cara, right? For example, he has, um, let's see, this one. He has brown hair, She has long hair, okay, pelo largo, pelo corto. We have it here, okay. Largo, long, corto, short, right? He has, él tiene, short hair, okay, pelo corto. Y si decimos, he has short, dark hair. Tiene el pelo corto, negro, right? El, y also we have this one, right? Pelo colocho, curly, okay, curly. Curly, ok. Tenemos el pelo ondulado. No es wavy, es wavy. Ok, wavy. Wavy. Tenemos el pelo liso. Straight. Straight. Ok, straight. Tenemos a la gente calva. Bold, ok, bold. A la gente que no tiene nadita de pelo, ok, bold. Eh, podemos, decir, podemos ocupar el has aquí, ok. He has, ok. Also, también podemos ocuparlo para esto, ¿ok? Para decir que tiene una cara redonda, a round face. She has round face. She has oval face. He has a mustache. Él tiene un bigote. He has a beard, ¿ok? Aquí vamos a ocupar el has, ¿ok? 
para decir cosas que tienen. Por ejemplo, en la cara. He has uh, green eyes, ¿ok? Ojos verdes. He has blue eyes, ¿ok? She has big eyes, ¿ok? Ojos grandes, ¿ok? Ojos grandes, big eyes. Ojos pequeños, small okay, eyes. ¿Ok, guys? Y para el resto, es el verbo to be, ¿ok? He is uh, an old woman, a, old, a young girl. She or he is tall. He is fat. He is thin, ¿ok? ¿Ok, guys? Now, let's see. We have these questions for tonight, right? We have this one. So, let me show someone to, you know, to explain me today. So, let's pick out, let's see, Jamilet. Jamilet, I'm going to choose you tonight. So, Jamilet, describe your mother. Describe your mother. My mother is beautiful. Nice. Mm -hmm. um, green eyes. She has, she has. Yes, she has. Green eyes. Green eyes, perfect. She has short hair. Short hair, nice. And that's all. <laughs> yeah. Okay, nice. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Jamil. And then, okay, perfect, guys. So, guys, cuando queremos decir eso es todo. Les voy a dar esta frase, ¿ok? Pueden ocupar esta frase siempre. That's all, ¿ok? That's all. Eso es todo, right? Eso es todo. That's all, ¿ok? That's all. Lo pueden pronunciar como... Uh, that's all, ¿ok? Tipo así, ¿ok? That's all, that's all, ¿ok? That's all. So, perfect. Now, let's see. Let's choose another one. Let's see. Um, Jose Araujo. Tell me. Describe your father. My father is friendly. Uh, mm -hmm. He has a small eyes. Small eyes, okay, eyes. Eyes. Mm -hmm. He has mustache. He has a mustache, perfect. That's all. That's all, perfect. Thank you, thank you. So that's all. So. Whenever you are finishing, guys, a sentence, always say that's all. Cuando terminen de hablar, siempre digan that's all para que ya sepa que está. Perfect. Thank you, Jose. Now let's choose Maria. Maria, describe your best friend. She's a liar, by the way. No, I'm kidding. So, perfect. Now tell me, Maria, describe your friend. My friend is Okay, thin, thin. He has mm -hmm. wrong. He has Javi, Javi, creo que es pelo colocho. Ah, curly, 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 mm -hmm. curly uh, hair. Curly. Curly hair. That, that all. That's all. Okay. Perfect. Very nice, Maria. Thank you. Now let's move on. Let's see. Let's choose a man tonight. So I know you want to participate. Yeah, you. I know you. Yeah. Juan, let's see. Juan, describe your president. My president is uh, a hardworking. Yeah. My president has, my president is a 
¿Cómo se dice barba? He has bird, aquí bird. He has, he has bird. Bird, ok. Um, uh, that's all. Ok, that's all. Perfect. So, Juan, remember, don't add add, ok? No agregue es add, ok? So, if you are going to say my president is hardworking, ok? Solo así, normal, ok? Recordemos la regla, ok? Primero, el subject, my president. Sorry, president. Luego, verb to be is. Y el adjetivo, right? Hard work. That's all, ok? No agreguemos el A, ok? But that's cool. Perfect. Now, well, I have two people. So, Jose Monhelm, help me describing your best friend. My best, my best friend, friend is friendly. He's, he is very tall. Perfect. And he has, he has a very mustache. Okay, perfect. Very nice. Thank you, Jose. Very good. Perfect. Oh no, let's see uh, who is missing for tonight. Uh, Jonathan. Jonathan, describe your mother. My mother is a beautiful, is mm -hmm. beautiful and tall. He is, he is tall. She is tall. And she is heavy hair. She's, she has, she has, remember, para las cosas que tiene, has, has curly hair. Has Curly hair. Mm -hmm. uh, he, he has long face. Okay, perfect. Long hair. Nice. So perfect, guys. Thank you so much for your participation tonight. So, guys, do you have any question about the adjectives? Tienen alguna pregunta? Yes, no. No. Well, adjectives, guys, para los adjetivos. The only thing that you have to do, la única cosa que tienen que hacer es aprenderse, right? Aprenderse qué significa cada uno, right? So what means speaky, curly, wavy, and straight, okay? Round, long, okay? Yes? ¿En qué momento se puede poner el has? Yeah, has, lo utilizamos, por ejemplo, aquí tenemos estos, ¿verdad? Estos seis. Has, lo vamos a utilizar para face, para hair, y para eyes. Más que todo para cosas que uno tiene, um, que uno tiene pues así en, en su cara, ¿ok? O en su cuerpo, ¿ok? So, pero en este caso, ocupar, lo vamos a ocupar en estos, ¿ok? Face, hair, and eyes. Porque has significa tener, ¿ok? Tener. En este caso, weight, height, height, sorry. La altura, la altura no es como, es como que decimos. Él es, ok, es. Y el verbo tu es ser o estar, right? So, él es alto. Ella es alta. She is tall. Ok, he's short. But if you don't want to confuse, si no te quieres confundir, eh, face, hair, and eyes, estos tres que ves aquí, vamos a ocupar has, ok, para estos tres, ok? Para estos tres. Y para estos tres que están aquí arribita, es el verb to be, ok, el verbo to be. Vamos a ocupar el is, ok, el is. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Uh, besides that, guys, any other question? ¿Alguna otra pregunta? No? Okay, no. perfect. So, guys, because we have time, porque tenemos tiempo now, let me show you. We are going, you know, to make an exercise of the platform, okay? So, let me see. Where do I have this one up here? Okay. So, well, here I have some other adjectives, if you can see, but we are not going to see them. So, uh, right now, let me show you this one, okay? So, we have this exercise. Let me share you the sound. Déjame compartir el sonido, chicos. And we are going to see what is this, okay? Este es un listening, guys. So, por eso es que va a ser bastante fácil. Ustedes solo van a escuchar cuál es la respuesta, okay? So, let's see how good is your listening, okay? Let's see.
se trabó ya. <ríe> ok, let me make a refresh. Sorry. Sorry, technical issues, technical problems for the moment. Do not worry. <ríe> so, but guys, as I mentioned to you, como les mencionaba, este es un listening, que es un audio. ¿Qué les va a decir? Ok. Ya vimos estos adjectives, ok. Ya vimos estos adjetivos. Que es tall, que es short, right? So let me make this slow. Dejen que cargue esta página. And we are going to see it. Okay? So, not this one, no. This one. Ok. So let's see. Vamos a ver si me deja correr el audio. One second. Perfect. Listen to four descriptions. Check the correct words. One. What's your friend Karen like? She's a little quiet, but she's really smart. Is she very tall? No. No, she's not. She's short. Okay. So in this case, guys, Karen is tall or short? Sure. Sure. Yeah, sure. Yeah, perfect. I have also here. Perfect, sure. Nice. Let's see the next one. Marco. Oh, yeah, no me deja. Well, <laughs> then let me see if I can make it. Bueno, chicos, si no les deja correrlo así como me está pasando a mí, pueden darle clic aquí, ok? Y abrirlo en una nueva pestaña. So let's see, ok? Let's see. Well, but use, ok. So I have it here. Listen to four descriptions. Really smart. Is she very tall? No. No, she's not. She's short. Okay, this one. She's short. Two. Who's that over there? My brother, Marco. He's only eight. Well, he's very cute. Marco? I don't think he's cute. But he's a little thin. Three. Okay. So Marco is... Heavy or thin? Heavy. Which one? What? Quiero ver en el chat dice Jose Araujo thin. And what about the rest? Thin. Thin, yeah. It is a, he's not heavy, he's thin. Perfect. Now let's hear this one. Elena. Wow, who's that? She's really pretty. Oh, that's my girlfriend, Elena. Really? What's she like? Well, she's pretty, and she's really friendly. Okay. So, ¿se escucharon al principio que decían, who's that? Who's that? ¿Quién es ella? It's Elena. Elena is friendly or shy? Friendly. Okay. Friendly. Friendly. Perfect. Now we have the last one, Andrew. Let's see. Four. What's Andrew like? Hmm. He's a little heavy, but he's very handsome. Is he funny? Funny? Uh, well, no. He's not funny, but he's very handsome. Okay. So, Andrew. Andrew is funny or serious? Serious. Yeah, serious. Ahí no mencionan que es serious, right? No mencionan serious. Solo dice que no es funny. And because it's not funny, it means it's serious, right? So, perfect. So, guys, these are, you know, the uh, questions, the last one that we have, it, okay? So, you see, all of them are correct, right? Este era el último ejercicio que teníamos del number three, okay? De la section number three. So all of these must to be finished, okay? Todo esto ya deben de estar terminados, okay? Because tomorrow, guys, tomorrow, we are going to have the exam, okay? The exam. So I have it here, okay? The exam. So it's kind of long. It's bastante largo. So for tomorrow, we are going to make the exam, okay? Not together, not together, because this is individual, okay? So... Please, espero que hayan terminado todos estos módulos, chicos, porque si no los han hecho, no van a poder hacer este examen. Okay? You have to finish this. Porque este examen viene de todo lo que hemos hecho, de todos estos, ¿ok? 
and about the homework, acerca también de la tarea que dejamos, right? So, guys, if you finish the homework about the countries, you can send me to the WhatsApp, okay? Pueden mandarme igual la tarea al WhatsApp, okay? La tarea de los países, nationalities, and language, okay? So, for extra points, right? So, perfect, guys. So, I guess it's time is over, and I hope to see you tomorrow, okay? Espero verlos mañana, chicos, en punto, right? Para que hagamos... Okay, la tarea. Yeah. How many questions for... For the exam. Um, it has many. Tiene bastantes. Um, no las he contado, pero son varias. Unas son cortitas. Es que tiene más que todo tareas así. Unas son cortitas, así que no se preocupen, pero es algo larguito. ¿okay? Por eso les digo que la sección 1 y 2 ya debieron haber estado terminadas. Right? Y la 3 la terminamos hoy. Right? So, but you know, right? tomorrow vamos you know, a como hacer un repaso de, todas, de todo lo que hemos visto hasta ahorita para que ustedes puedan realizar el examen, ¿ok? So, guys, tomorrow I see you here. Have a good night, you know. Tengan una buena noche. And mañana es el examen. Nos vemos, ¿ok? So, see ya. Bye, bye. Eh, una pregunta. Yes. Eh, usted dijo que podíamos enviar lo de los países. Yeah. Sí, a mi ¿Sería WhatsApp. ¿Sería el grupo? O no, o no. Uh, a mi personal pueden enviarlo, pero si gustan, bueno. Puede ser el grupo o el personal, no importa. Cualquiera de los dos. Pero so, el personal no lo ha dado, ¿verdad? <risas> uh, no, pero el personal está ahí en, en el grupo de, de WhatsApp. Yo les escribo. Yo soy el que les mando las imágenes. So you can take um, it. Bye. Yeah. Bye, so, bye. bueno, guys. Good night and take care, okay? Good night. See ya. Good night. Bye. Good night. Bye. Good night. bye.